Welcome back YouTube, another video in the S2K. And today I thought about I would talk or I thought I would talk about something that's been on my mind um, and something that I'm going through now, right? It's things that, you know, there's obviously stuff that we go through in life and we have to have some sort of faith, right? That we're going to persevere. Um, and so this is something that's personally, you know, has always worked for me. It's personally always gotten me through, you know, tough times. And it's just basically believing, you know, I'm a believer of God, right? So for me personally, I believe that God is going to be the source that is going to give me what I need when the time comes, right? Uh, if you're not a believer of God, I mean, I would highly encourage you to be one. But if not, I'm not going to force anything down your throat. So you got to believe in some sort of source, right? You got to believe in manifestation, especially if you're going for success. And so when the topic of this video is going to say like, you know don't worry about your future and what i mean by that is i don't mean like just flow through life right and and not have a plan and not have goals and not work and and just be like everything's gonna come to me because i believe it's gonna come to me because nothing's gonna come to you if you're not putting in the effort of the work that you need to do and in the bible it shows and if i can find the verses i will but i believe it might be in uh, one of the proverbs maybe um ecclesiastes but it tells you basically that as long as you're putting the work in you know you're gonna get what you need right and and it even mentions like the birds don't worry about where the food is coming from so why should we right and so the type of person that i used to be let's say like three four years ago i would stress heavily being in positions of not having my finances together i would stress heavily if my relationships weren't going right i would be like man i would be like just you know losing my mind right and um you know it took me time and it also took you know my spiritual journey right my spiritual journey is really what put me in this position of, of having this belief in this faith and so in times of where I didn't know how I was going to pay my rent, I didn't know how I was going to fill up my gas tank, I didn't know if I was going to be able to afford my meal preps, my gym membership, you know, anything like that. Um, now, like when I'm working, I know that it's going to come right. I'm not stressing about it. I'm not even thinking about it, especially in times like right now where the market is extremely slow for real estate agents or anybody in that field, right? The real estate industry. And, you know, you could be doing whatever you're doing at the end of the day and things could be not going the way that you want them to go. But as long as you keep putting in that work and believing and having faith that what you're you're going to get, you know, by still doing what you have to do, it's going to come. Like it's, it's undoubtedly gonna come as long as you have faith. And it's almost like you could say like manifestation for me. Like I believe in manifestation, don't get me wrong. Although, um, you know, I follow Christ, but I personally believe that God is seeing me, right? God is watching me. God knows that I'm not here worried about where like my stuff's gonna come from. And, um, you know, sometimes, you know, we have thoughts, I'm human, right? I'm, I'm not gonna be perfect. I'm gonna have my moments where I have self doubt, uh, you know, in my mind, or I have, you know, these creeping thoughts of like, what if I, this doesn't close? What if I don't have enough money for rent? What if I end up homeless, right? Things like that. But it's, um, you know, of course those thoughts are there, but you don't feed into them. And and I keep working, right? Like those thoughts have never been there. I keep working like I'm not in the position of, of, of losing my, my home or I'm not in the position of worrying about my, like getting gas and things like that, right? I, I just keep doing what I have to do. I keep doing what I have to do. And what happens is it always, 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 always shows up. Even if it's at the last minute, there's times where like, I had like negative something in my account, right? And then all of a sudden an opportunity um, just appears, right? It just appears out of nowhere. And the next day I can have like $5,000 in my account from negative to 5,000, right? And it just so happens to be that I've noticed that like a few times throughout my journey as an entrepreneur. And in the beginning, it wasn't as easy, right? Because you're just getting into this. It's unknown. Everything's fearful. Everything's scary. But when you really truly believe that you are going to have are always going to have what is like naturally provided and and that could just be you know you got to be grateful if you have a house or a roof over your head that's you know that's already a blessing if you have food on your table that's already a blessing if you have a car that's already a blessing if you don't have some of these things or you're struggling to get some of these things then that's where your faith is, is, is tested, right? And not just in God, like I said, it can be in manifestation, it can be the higher power, whatever you believe in, but your faith is going to be tested in these like down times and that's where you have to persevere the most. That's you know where your character is built and that's where you discover that as long as you are doing what you need to do, 
then you are going to get what you need. And and there's times where I've uh, just, you know, real quick before I end this video here, there's times where I've like, I've made tons of calls, I've done door knocking, I've done all these things, right? And I'm not getting anything from that, from what I'm actually exerting, right? But I've already had faith that because I'm doing the work, that an opportunity will come up and it doesn't have to be an opportunity from what I'm doing. It could just be an opportunity that comes to me. And that has happened so many different times where I have gotten a call. I went and showed a house the same day. I got it under contract. It had nothing to do with the work that I was putting in. It came from an outside source, right? It came from an outside source. And, and it put me back in the position like where, man, I'm back in the game. I'm back in the game. And so just keep doing what you have to do. So the purpose of this video, like I said, is you have to you have to put the work in. You're not you can't just expect something to come to you just because you have faith, right? You you if you have faith, then you're going to understand that the work that you're putting in is going to bring value. It's going to put you where you need to be. So just keep pushing. Don't stop in your low days. And I know it's hard. We're there. I'm human, right? I get sad, too. But keep pushing through. Have faith in yourself and you're gonna achieve the goals that you wanna achieve. Okay, can you know us? Dreaming, talking, in your sleep, I know you want to cry all night.